Admiral, a group of our people are trying to create a new homeworld. Sila's capital city has erupted into fighting since she disappeared. So-called saviors struggle for power, and new ones rise and fall every day. We are witnessing the end of an empire. I belong to a group of Romulans who, like you, want to survive. With our leader, Datan, we are throwing off the shackles of our past. We reject secrecy and deceit in favor of democracy and cooperation. In creating a new world, we will remake our culture. We have found a planet called Mulrihan, New Romulus in our mother tongue. It can be ours, but we have much to do before we can truly call it home. Our government has authorized me to ask you for assistance. Our people have been in strife for too long. Can you look past our history and help us build a new world? Good morning, everybody. Old love here, and welcome back to Star Trek Online. So we are starting a new uh, a new season, as it were. Uh, this particular season is called New Romulus. Uh, obviously, we have to go to New Romulus and and deal with stuff and see what's going on here, as far as you know. They're trying to create a new Romulan homeworld and everything like that, but without. Empress Sila or anything like that. Sounds like the whole empire is just breaking down. So I'm guessing we just have to go up here and like beam down. Yeah, beam to New Romulus. Admiral, we are ready to beam down to New Romulus at your command. The Romulans are suggesting we bring a small away team. Okay. Well, small away team, two people. I mean, that's not really an away team. I mean, technically, it would be a team because it's more than one person. But still, that that's not really a team. It's just not. It's a duo. It's an away duo. That, that sounds better. We have the strength now. With the help of Starfleet and the Empire, we could destroy what's left of the Tal Shiar. We would be safe. We would be free. There are too few of us left to fight amongst ourselves. Military action should be our last option. I don't see how talking to them will be enough. But I'm a warrior, not a politician. If my people are to find a home here, there must be a leader capable of building a new future, of looking past our differences to find harmony. You are that leader, Detan. Since I was a child, hiding in the sewers of the capital with the reunificationists, I have worked toward the day when the Romulans would once again walk beside their Vulcan brothers and sisters. Before that can happen, we need to rebuild. We need a home to replace what was lost, to see past our grief and find acceptance. We need to reconcile with the Remans and end the centuries of strife and oppression. The fate of both our peoples rests here. We either create a new home world out of the ashes, or we wither and die. Well, that's, um... Thank you for agreeing to assist us. I'm grateful that both the Federation and the Empire have temporarily put aside their differences to help create a new Romulus. No this problem. This proves that unification is possible, both for my people and for yours. We're building a new home here. Romulans and Remans can't continue on like nothing has changed. Everything is different. We are a changed people. The loss of Romulus wounded us greatly. But that wound will not be fatal. Good! There is a great deal of work to do before we can truly call this our new home. But with your help, I know Mold Rihan, or New Romulus in your language, will someday be as great as what we lost. Kylor is in charge of the staging area. He can give you more information about what we need. There's much to do, and little time. We left our first home to remain free. 
we lost our adopted home to treachery. May this world be the home we have sought for so long, a place where our descendants can live in peace. Well, they do say the third time's the charm. Hi, welcome to New Romulus. Let me brief you on the situation here. Cool. We're building a new city here, at the site where people first landed on this world more than 2,000 years ago, after the Sundering. Awesome. Our Riemann friends will take the lower levels, where they can feel most at home. Makes sense. We'll use the staging area as a landing site for shuttlecraft, and a place to coordinate construction and future shipping. Many of our records were lost with the home world. But what we do have indicates that there was a battle here before the colony ships left to find Romulus. You found what could be the Sword of the Raptor Star, one of our most revered artifacts here on this world. I did? There's still much we need to learn about this world and its inhabitants. This creature, for example. How, How does it, did it float? adapt to the radiation that until recently made this world unsuitable for colonization? Recent scans are showing the radiation falling into manageable levels. With modern technology and your assistance, this should be a place where the Romulan and Riemann people can thrive for generations to come. We've found ruins that date back to the Sundering and beneath them, signs of what may be a much older civilization. Really? Who lived here eons ago? What happened to them? We're doing what we can, but we can't do it alone. If you're here to help, I'll get you started. Well, I'm not here for vacation, that's for sure. Okay, so... Staging area. Objectives, uh, help in the staging area, repair equipment, investigate suspicious persons, collect and turn in science, engineering, and medical reports, and motivate civilian workers. Okay. We can do that. I'm good at motivating people. See this big old phaser on my hip? Yeah, that motivates them real good. <laughs> okay, so... Scan the radiation. I don't know how much, how, what score I need to get. I really don't know what score I need to get on this, but I, I, I obviously I'm gonna get a pretty good score. At least what I think is a pretty good score. All right, few results. Uh, conduct repairs. Oh, I'm repairing that piece of equipment over there. Good to know. Uh, turn in radiation reports. Collect markers. Uh, okay. I think I did good? Talk to the overseer. Uh, let's see here. If you're not too busy, collect reports from centurions who are working in the station area. Doing so will give you a good feel for the area. All right, cool. Hi, Mr. Klingow. What's going on in here? Science report. I need that. Thank you, guys. All right, what do you need? Uh, I'm just going to conduct repairs. 
Never don't don't mind me. I'm just doing your job. Uh What are the Virian? Uh, vile insects th with their stingers can pierce even the thickest armor. We believe that they have, are involved, that they evolved such powerful stingers to pierce the hard shells of predators. They were still unsure what they propose, what the Veherans propose is in the overall eco purpose. Wow. We're still unsure what the Viharan's purpose is in the overall ecological view of this place. I would hesitate to say that they should that we should wipe them all out. As dangerous as they are, there is a reason why they have evolved to their current state. True. What about the Epol? The Epol are small cute creatures. We have called them Epol or pet. Due to many scientists taking the creatures in as pets, they do not mind the presence of humanoids. On the contrary, they seem they become very amiable towards us, rubbing themselves against our hands and legs and letting out small cooing sounds. The size and color of the Epo indicate that they have barely survived all these years. They must be a target of most predators, but they will not evolve to fight them. The Epo simply evolved to avoid them, growing smaller and more agile to hide in various nooks and crannies. They tend to live in groups of four or five and are nomadic, moving from place to place throughout the forests, such as such is the life of a small creature on the run from larger predators. This is another reason why many Romulans have taken the Epo at, on as pets. They are a species that are hunted on the run and looking for a home. Kind of like, okay, hi, hi. What are you doing sneaking around here? I keep an eye out for anything strange. Okay, you're kind of, you're kind of strange. Wait, didn't I already repair this? Yes, I did, but I'll repair it again, apparently. Anything else to repair or check out? It doesn't look like it. All right, well, I think that's where we're going to leave this one for today. Uh, it is kind of partway into a an episode, but this is my, like a, a much more expansive episode, it looks like. So yeah, uh, we are going to be, you know, we are going to be helping things get settled in New Romulus and help them kind of get everything, un you know, get everything in order and get, get everything straight and ready to go. As always, thank you guys very much for watching and don't forget to prod the subscribe button down below so that you can... Stay tuned for more from Olav Productions. If you want to see Cheerio. Fragmented, ripped apart, and all the fragmented pieces have been locked away in different parts of the foundry. Simple, or rich or evil. You've come to my kingdom, Alice, and bring gifts. I know of your deeds and skills, they are formidable. I want to test you with an ancient